Yeah, guys, 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 we are back, guys. Shout out to everybody, man. Shout out to the subs. Shout out to everybody who clicked on this. So, guys, yeah, well, obviously we're back with some more. Because um, obviously, if you saw earlier in the year, we did big ideas. And, um, yeah, it was now talking about ideas. This is my idea. It was my idea to listen to this. So, um, yeah, if any of you guys think it's your idea to listen to this you're wrong it was my <laughs> no i'm just kidding shout out to beastie music shout out to beastie music who is actually the reason we're listening to this um who left a uh, comment saying you gotta hear this we got, i got you i got you don't worry we're here we're here we're queer we don't need more bears i'm ready to uff um let's get it <laughs> I, 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 i'm ready to uff guys tell me somebody remembers uffy come on guys Uffy, 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 of course. Guys, there's no date on here. It just says 2022. So I don't know what year this came. I mean, what the date? I know the year. <laughs> I just said the year. I don't know the exact date, I should say. But released sometime in 2022. Guys, we got Juno from Remy Wolf. <laughs> That it didn't resolve at the end though so you guys know how much i love when music doesn't resolve Baby 
It sounds like Slow Dive decided to go pop or something. <laughs> this is crazy.
so cloudy, yeah And I don't have feelings I feel my family dynamics Like a red hot chili pepper I love my family intrinsically Like Anthony Kiedis
Two five, two five, one. Two, three.
tire those off this off one too. Turtleneck sweater, got that long hair, long beard. 
Ah, I just stuck it out there. I don't know if this is gonna end, but.
Looking for ways that I 
what we just heard like it was so first of all it was a great album for to, to smoke to i'll say that <laughs> i gotta get that out of the way the whole time i was smoking listening to this like this is this is perfect um it was such like uh like i don't even know how to say it because like all right like it sounded like like such its own sound but not its own sound but its own sound you know what i mean it was obviously sort of drawing from a lot of sounds but like but like it w it just sounded kind of like you very unique in a way you know what i mean like there was something about the combination of everything you know the combination of the lyrics i mean everything obviously is on my phone i say ever i'm just gonna start naming stuff but <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I mean? But those lyrics with the melodies, you know, and then the, with the changes, but then with the production, like, it all just, you know, it, the production in particular, too, was very, um, trying to, maybe not trying to be, like, the most different thing ever, but you know what I mean? It wasn't, this wasn't, like, a very... How do I say it? Like, I, you, this is not something that you're going to hear somebody else sounding like this. You know what I mean? Like, it's very this thing you know and uh like like it's whole thing basically <laughs> you know what i mean so i thought it was really like fire not just because of that but i'm saying that's part of what i thought really made it fire um but yeah i mean just you know for me at the end of the day I, I i i like the main thing for me i know for most people it comes down to lyrics i i i, I realize that how many people will like or not like a song based on the lyrics but and and i do care about I, lyrics do matter to me but for me the most important thing out of all even i love production too and the and the and the harmony obviously all this stuff like chord progression all that stuff but the melodies to me are like if you don't have a good melody it's like what's the point you know like i don't care what your lyrics are if the melody stinks i don't care about what the fucking cool harmonies or you know, I mean chord progressions i mean like whatever the pro production like if this melody sucks this melody sucks like we need good melodies you know what i'm saying and all the melodies on here were fire and kind of like sort of like there was like kind of trippy little like non because i don't know how to say like non typical non kind of there's like a certain like formulaic thing 
that you, you do when it comes to writing melodies for like a like certain genres, I guess. Every genre sort of has its own kind of thing, you know what I mean? There's certain types of melodies that, that are common in it, you know what I mean? And in particular, like in anything like pop or anything kind of, I don't know, you know what I mean? There's a certain way that you kind of write to like have it be catchy and to have it be whatever. So like, my point is like, there's a lot, a lot of these melodies were doing things that you would not do <laughs> if you're trying to do that, you know what I mean? And there, were, and there were kind of like certain words like, whoa, 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 where did that come, you know what I mean? Also, speaking on the changes though, you know what I mean, on the, on the harmony, um, again, harmony meaning the changes, the chord progression, not the vocal harmonies, the, the harmony of the music. Um, I like that there was a lot of, not just that there was a lot of two fives or like two five one shit, not obviously, I mean, obviously I play jazz, I wouldn't love anything with a two five in it, but like, <laughs> but like, I like that there was a lot of, like you could tell that th that this was written with an instrument. Do you know what I mean? This wasn't like like making a four bar loop and then writing like a top line to it. I mean, like writing a melody that goes along with the with the four bar loop, and then you write a second melody and then a third melody, and then you try to put it together. And this is it wasn't like maybe some maybe it was written like that, but it didn't come off like that. This this felt you could hear. Like I'm 99 percent sure because you can hear it. You can, it sounded like it was somebody just wrote it like with an instrument. Because like the way the changes were, the way certain like a lot of the songs, there was not. It was not just that same four or eight bar loop. It was, you know what I mean? Like the the changes were like actually changing like throughout the song. Like how, you know, music was forever. You know, <laughs> up until whatever. No, not forever. That was the modal era. Was in freaking 900. <laughs> no, that was like almost over a thousand years ago it's like 1200 years ago whatever the point is um yeah this was uh this was super fire is my point i really i really really dug it um and that i gotta say the the last song i mean i guess i'm guessing obviously because it's a deluxe version i don't know where the actual album version ends or not but um including the including that song and then and then a live after like with the with the actual bat so perfect so perfect because you know it's one of those things where it really shows too like the difference in like the production how how it gives it a whole different feel or the arrangement and all that can give it a whole different feel but the song itself the composition itself will still be fired throughout you know and it's still that was just ah that was really good that was really good man guys shout out to everybody man i love you guys uh guys we'll be back anything else i need to check out put it in the comments guys We'll get to it. It might take a little bit, but we'll get to it, guys. And in the description, go check out my music, guys. That's all I care about, guys. I don't care about this channel, guys. Go check out the channel I care about. It's right there, guys. In the description, check out my music. And, guys, we'll be back.